This is the All Weasel Let's Play Saga Frontier. Who? In the last episode, we wussed out of one mission and decided to try another mission. So that was great and fun and all that. And I decided that since I had wussed out of one mission and decided to try another mission, that I would do a little bit of grinding off screen. Uh, now I've changed my on-screen grinding policy, I think that the side window grinding was a little bit annoying, so if you do want to see uh, the, the grinding done for this video, that is on my second channel, Yawizel Uncut, and the link is in the description below. Anyway, so I was grinding, and then this happened! Slow load times. This happened! I won't let you get away! Oops! I guess we're fighting a boss now? I'm not sure what triggers these events, it might just be a certain amount of building up, or it might be just time. If it's just time, then who? I'm glad I was grinding and not just totally wasting time. Anyway, let's try and get uh, Acellus into Mystic Mode. What is this guy? Is he water-based? I, I, it doesn't give a name for him. He's blue, so I'm guessing he's water-based, so I'm gonna go ahead and try using... Uh, the, the, oops, it, I, that actually showed his name. It was something sage, as expected. Mystical change! Please don't kill me. Okay, okay, I should be fine. And especially I should be fine if these two are apparently doing a combo. Awesome! Let's see how many, uh, how many, how much damage this does. We're a very magic-oriented party. Okay, 1,118. That's not bad. Is he holding a chainsaw? Oops, not that one. Phantasm shot. Oh, Water Sage. Yeah, so definitely fire was good. Implosion should be fine. I don't know. I don't know. I guess Flash Fire is actually a light spell. I don't know if there's a... Uh, oh, that didn't work. I don't know if there's a... Uh, fire magic. I don't really remember. And we haven't looked into it. But, you know, light fire, whatever. And besides, this is a combo, so it's obviously pretty alright. There are level 3 combos as well, by the way. The level of the combo is just how many people are involved. Are you really this weak, Sage? The last Sage was pretty, uh, pretty unimpressive as well. I'm just gonna keep using this until I'm out of, uh, Japanese points for those guys. Oh, man. <laughs> Combos are awesome. I love the combinations in this game. They, I, I, they're not random. Only certain things can be combined. But there is some probability that you'll discover it. And so... Ooh, that, that looks bad. Or it does 79 damage! Who boy, really afraid now. Oops, don't need to use another glass shield. Phantasm shot didn't work last time, but who knows, maybe that was just unfortunate and random. Oh, <laughs> oh I love this game! I have a level 3 combination, a level 3 magic combination! Oh, let's see if this just kills him. That would be great. 2,726. Not bad. Well, I know what I'm doing this round. <laughs> oh, man. I'm so glad that you could see this with me. <laughs> well, that was pathetic. Wow. I thought this was gonna be a boss video, but instead I spent three minutes on that lame boss. Intelligence, and psychic, and Japanese points, and hit points, and Japanese points, and the Genbu shield, which I'm sure is good. Oh wow, and it just throws me right back in. Okay. So, if that's the way things are gonna be, I'm just gonna check if the Genbu shield is better. Waterproof and cancels physical attacks, and I think that means that I can now have a spare shield to give him. Okay. So, if that's the way things are gonna be, and they're just gonna be totally random encounters, or I guess it wasn't really random, it was presumably based on my level, or the amount of uh, enemies I'd killed, or something. I don't know, the point is it's not based on the amount of actual sort of game quests I've completed. So as a result, I think it's probably in my best interest to at least try to actually complete a quest, and just sort of go for it. So I'm gonna go back to that quest that we had found before, the quest that was in... Oh good, I don't even remember what the place was called! Perfect! It'll be easy to find that way. But, uh, ooh, maybe... well, no. So, we're gonna go back to that quest, and just sort of try and power through it. 
<laughs> it might be difficult, but eh, we just took down a sage, so how bad can it be, really? Where to? Oh, remind me through the internet, people. Where were we? Was it Kyo? Was it Shingro? Shingro, Shingro, Shingro. Secretly, this is a loading screen. Don't tell the Saga Frontier guys I know that. So these ruins seem interesting because they are the ruins of a ship and not the ruins of, you know, something else. Remember, you can see this battle uh, on screen by watching Yawi's All Uncut. Yawi's a guest death! Victory! Okay, these guys are suddenly very tough. When did this happen? There's a change! That guy was really wussy before. Why did he kill Rouge twice and totally demolish the rest of us? Excuse me? Was that just randomly difficult? He always will cast death question mark? Victory! Yep, these enemies are definitely pretty tough, but oh well. I guess if I just get in big trouble, I'll have to try and escape. Magic stones are good. They're probably good for escape. What they do is attack all of the enemies. And they're, they seem to be a fairly common pickup from enemies, too. Or at least not exceptionally rare. Okay. I, I just, I feel like I need to at least try to attack some enemies to see how bad this is gonna be. Always a cast death! Victory! I feel like Rouge is a real liability here. Will, and hit points, and Japanese points, and hit points, and a steel amulet, and 30 credits. Okay. Rouge, you gotta stop being such a liability. Ah, I feel much better about cutting out battles when- Oh, great, this guy did bad next time. I feel much better about cutting out battles when the very curious can see them later. Yo, he's a cast death! Victory! Okay, that one wasn't too bad. Japanese points, oh, when he found some- He found- He got some Realmic magic and I clicked to it- <laughs> Clicked through it too quickly for me to know what it was. I guess everybody else is being a little bit more balanced than he is. He's, uh, focusing almost entirely on magic. Psychic Prison seals enemies' magic power in a cage. That sounds like it could be useful against some of these particularly annoying enemies. Great! Dead end. Oh, not dead end. Okay, glad I clicked randomly. Oh, wow, look at this. This is a big screen. Yo, he's a cast death! You know what, actually, I'm gonna leave this battle in only because I don't think I've seen these bats before, and I'm trying... I, I think I should start trying, that is, to actually leave in battles when they're sort of things I've never seen before. Okay, let's use Energy Chain. Mystical Change! I assume that's something? I don't know. I Don't kill him. Don't kill her, either. Do kill him! Yes! Oh man, I am glad I just developed this combo, because Fan Phantasm Shot and Energy Chain are like my go-to spells. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to use it again, because, uh, well, I don't know, maybe they can do the, uh, do it as well? Oh, I didn't check what Acellus was at. How do I do that? Not like that. Like that. Okay. 23 or 19, who do I trust not to die? Neither of them, they'll both die, but this guy's usually more pathetic. Nope, somebody's dead. He's dead. Oh well. <laughs> so, no Phantasm Shot Energy Chain combo this time. Uh, of course, and he's gonna die, so I don't even get to build up Rouge with this battle. Oh well. Japanese points and Beast Leather. I think Beast Leather is actually pretty decent. Let me go ahead and rearrange my equipment in fast motion. Bzzz Never mind, there's really no rearranging to be done. Oh god, no no, let me get- It's junk! Perfect! So glad I could find some junk. Let's run away from the enemies. Run away from all your problems. That is the best way to do things. Well, these are problems I'm not running away from so well. Oh well, yo, he's a cast death! Oh, actually, let's cut back in because... I just saw a new combination, Sharp Shot from Acellus plus his energy chain. Very nice, very nice. I love the combo system. H points raised and Japanese points raised. This game, I don't know, the... Ooh, Focus Shot. New gun technique. So, 
the the leveling of the enemies seems very oh I was trying to click into the menu quickly. Yo is a cast death! So, I was saying that some of the enemies are really pathetic, and other ones take down our entire team without even trying. I am now completely screwed. <laughs> there is nothing I can do. Vermilion Sand. Except he's going to die now. Oh, that didn't kill him, which is surprising, but that did. There we go. Oh, what a familiar screen this is. Okay, super good. Excuse me while I reload again. When was the last time I saved? I need to save more often. Okay, note to self, this game is tough. Save more frequently. <laughs> Look where we are! Not in, uh, I don't again, I've forgotten the name of that place. Not in Shingro. Uh, you see, some of the enemies very easy, some of the enemies not so much. Well, wait, I have 2,186 gold. Surely I can afford something. Some modestly better equipment than I already have. And I think Kurong would be the place to do it, because there were people selling all sorts of stuff around here. This jerk doesn't even want to talk to me! Okay, how about, oh yeah, that guy just said, like, Blessed are these people. I don't want to sell leather and fur. Well, maybe I do. If I'm not using them, then sure, you can have them. Uh, yes? Sell what? Go? Sell. There we go. <laughs> okay. Sell! I- what? <laughs> oh, I see. Okay. You press down to, uh, to sell? I don't know. That's, <laughs> that's very confusing. Okay, fine. Shoes. Defense power 7 and protection against Quake for 250. And I already have that on somebody. You have no shoes. You have defense power 10. You have jet boots. Can you not wear shoes with the rubber suit? Probably not. Okay, not gonna buy that then. There was other stuff upstairs. <laughs> this is mildly desperate since I don't seem to actually be finding any great deals on great things. <laughs> oh, Kurong. This was not the right place to shop. Okay. Defense power 7 or 8. Both for 300, so the laser scope must have some benefit it's not mentioning here. That's not too, too bad. So who doesn't have a helmet? Well, you probably can't wear one because you're wearing a rubber suit. You don't have one. You don't have one. Let's buy two and then see whether uh, a Celis can use one. There we go. Hopefully anybody can use one. I'll feel really stupid if nobody can use one at all. Sorry, I'm going to have to take away your flower amulet. There we go. Ah, it also protects against blind status, mirror glass. Yeah, that taking away her flower amulet slightly reduces her psychic and charm. Let's see how much it reduces it. 45 and 38. 50 and 43. Those are actually pretty significant. Uh, maybe I want to replace one of these instead. Slightly better than the harmonium bangle. Worse than that anklet. Why would you get rid of... I want your mystic mail! It seems pretty good, actually! Oh, I can rearrange it. That's strange. Okay, I'm gonna do this off uh, in fast motion. Okay, helmet sorted to the best of my ability. Huh, well, the powered suit is sure hoo 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 good if I could ever afford it, which of course I can't. Combat suit seems eh, not totally unaffordable, and it has 15 defense, that's not bad. This has 18 defense. Mm -mm -mm. I don't know what the difference between armor and armor suit is. But let's try buying one of these. I can certainly afford one. And see where I can put it. Okay, so that's that goes there. But the rubber suit is pretty darn good. I doubt that I can construct a better thing for her, even though she doesn't have... You know, even though the suit take the rubber suit takes the place of all sorts of other things. All right, I can't change her mystic mail, so it looks like it was just going to be him anyway. And the blue elf has defense power twenty. Let me do some more stuff in fast motion. 
Okay, I reloaded since there was really nothing better to be done, so that was a waste of time. Let's get back to the mission at hand, as it were. And actually, I'm going to fast forward back to approximately where I was already. The lesson here, if there is one, is do not underestimate mechs. Oh my gosh, they are the toughest characters in the... Or the toughest enemies in the game. Oh, received item Machine Vulcan. I think that that's uh, only, for, only for mechs, and of course I am not one. I am a... Oh no! That was the last thing in the world I wanted to do. No, 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 no. Okay, you're a plant. Yo, he's a cast death! Victory, and then immediately run away. Run away, I am ready to run away. I am ready to run away. Okay, I'm holding left and run. Run away. Run away. Run away. No, no, no. Oh. I'm gonna leave this battle in. This guy is basically a boss to me. This is basically a boss battle here. Looks easy? No, no, no. They will kill me. <laughs> they will kill me a lot. All the defensive magic you have, please. Psycho armor, just for giggles, you know. A psycho armor, unlike glass shield, you can use on anyone. That won't kill her instantly, but one more attack to Acellus and she will be dead. This won't kill either of them. But if either of them attack, then Rouge is dead. Rouge is now dead and so is Acellus. Oh, Rouge survived. <laughs> you can see I've become a bit of a pessimist when it comes to these mechs, because they are really tough and continue to kill me. Okay, you try and bring back Acellus, you use Vermilion Sand, even though you'll be dead before you have the chance. <sighs> Getting real tired of this, mechs. Getting real tired of this, mechs. Okay, next time we'll pick up where we left off. Luckily, I'm saved right in this room. I'll probably die to these mechs 10 or 11 more times. Everybody else seems relatively easy, but the mechs? What are you supposed to do? I guess maybe it's just because magic isn't all that effective against mechs or something. I don't know. One way or another, next time we'll pick up from where we left off here and maybe figure out what's going on with this ancient ship. Until then, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, feel free to leave a like below. Cheers! From Yaweasel.